Good morning, Fort Myers, and welcome to Good Morning Green Wave. I'm Casey Wexler. And I'm Melissa Taylor. Thanks so much for tuning in this Thursday morning. Today is April 18th. We have a lot to get to this morning, but before we get to those stories, let's check out today's weather. For that, we go to Palmer. Thanks, Casey. Now to our forecast. Right now, it's 70 degrees in Fort Myers. There's no rain expected this morning under sunny skies, but as we move into the afternoon, it gets hot and sticky. There's an expected high of 89 degrees. It will be mostly cloudy with a 20% chance of rain. That's all for your forecast. Now, back to the anchors. Thank you, Palmer. Now to our top story. The Animal Dodgeball Tournament is today. There are dozens of teams ready to compete for their chance to dominate the competition. Make sure to go to the gym right after school to get a good seat. Admission to watch the event is only $3. Prom tickets are on sale again today. Just go to the Commons area during lunch. All fees and fines need to be paid before you can buy a ticket. Prom will be at Harborside Event Center on April 13th. The event runs from, from the 8th, 8 until 11. This year, DJ Ram OG from 105.5 The Beat will be there. The end of the year is quickly approaching. That means it's time for Mr. Greenwave. Mr. Greenwave is a pageant for senior guys to show off their beauty, talent, and overall love for our school. The winner gets to hold the distinguished title of Mr. Greenwave. This event will be held on April 17th and is always a must-see. The show starts at 7 and admission is only $3. Good morning, Greenwave. Needs to take a quick break. When we return, Amanda has your sports news. We'll be right back. Good morning, sports fans. I'm Amanda Schlichten. Here's the latest sports news. Just going to pass a, quick, or a couple of quick notes to you. First of all, best of luck to our Lady Wave tennis team as they head to regionals today. Also, the boys tennis team concluded their season this past weekend, or Wednesday, sorry. They lost a very hard fought sem regional semifinal match against Naples High, 4-3. The team looked to avenge their loss to Naples from earlier on in the season, but fell short in the seventh and deciding match. Please congratulate the guys for a great season. They are excited for next season when they look to defend their district title. Great job, guys. Finally, as you heard earlier, the dodgeball tournament is today. Get ready to witness perfect athleticism and head to the gym as soon as the last bell rings. That's all the sports news on this Thursday. Now back to the anchors. That's all the news we have for you today. I'm Casey Wexler. And I'm Melissa Taylor. Have a wonderful day.